see my grandmother when I was a little kid, you know, with her holding my hand and walking down the street. And she would see someone and go, what's that? And eventually learned that it was called the Maloik. And the Maloik was, someone's giving us the evil eye, so she's giving it protection against the evil eye. Or you can give someone the evil eye too. I'm lucky enough to have kind of, uh, just have done it so much, it's been more equated with me than anyone else. Although Gene Simmons will tell you that he invented it. But then again, Gene invented breathing and shoes and everything, you know. My belief in heaven and hell is heaven and hell is right here. This is where we are. This is heaven, this is hell. You make your own heaven, you make your own hell. Hell, good and evil, God, the devil, reside in each one of us. I don't have to go to a place to pray. Yeah, I can pray inside myself. I can pray to whomever I want to inside myself and get the same results. I don't need to be told by a priest that I'm bad or to be told by a nun that I'm not learning my project properly and get smacked on the head and with a ruler. Who the hell are you to do that to me? Or to be told that here's God and God is a guy who's been nailed up on a piece of wood. It's not the way I want to think of, of life. I don't think of it that way. And with all the religions that they are preaching all the same things, it's real one great big homogenized thing anyway. At the end of the day, if we all just believe in the same thing, you know, that we got a choice between good and evil. Hey, make your choice. That's all it's about to me. MTV killed heavy metal music. You suddenly had the hair bands coming out. It was only about what they looked like and uh, how many parties they could have and how many, how many, you know, 14 year old girls they could pull after the show. I mean, the music was rubbish, and and they destroyed what the rest of us created because everyone got lumped in together with it. That should be an emblem somewhere, you know. Poison killed everything. I'm not, not honestly, those kind of bands did do that. I think these things that come out and, you know, and wear makeup and you know what's that all about this that's not metal it was probably oh i don't know midnight and uh, i happened to look out the window and i said uh, yeah, the moon looks awfully big i said wendy that wasn't out there a minute ago that moon and she looked and said oh it must have been so, packing more okay so i looked a few minutes later and it was bigger and it was bigger and bigger and coming closer and closer and closer and closer. I thought, oh my God, this is it, the big one. I was so excited. As it got closer, we saw a car coming, where we lived was kind of in a foresty area. So one lone car coming down a hill. And as this car was coming down, it was just about to intersect this light. And I thought, he's gonna take this car away. This car is now gonna shoot up into this, whatever this thing may be. And I was, you know, <gasps> with bated breath. And the car got to the intersection point and suddenly, it went out. But it didn't go out as though you would take a flame, blow the flame out where there's an afterglow. It was as if someone had taken a black curtain and gone. Don't talk to strangers, cause they're only there to do you harm. Don't ride in starlight Cause the words may come out real Don't hide in doorways You may find the key That opens up your soul Don't go to heaven Cause it's really only here I think it's time to do a Gene I Simmons, because I understood that Gene had found out that the that OJ, as in orange juice, had never been patented before, so he patented it. Really? <laughs> so now every time anyone mentions OJ, not only I don't know about OJ Simpson, but orange juice, that he gets some money from it, which seems so Gene-ish to me, because you know? he's so brilliant at that. He just absolutely yeah. brilliant. Yeah. They needed someone, uh, I guess, with you know a figurehead of my strength to do it, so they asked me to do it. I said, no, I don't want to do it. I have something else to do. And uh, I eventually had to because it, they did need someone stronger at the helm. So I said, all right, I'll do it. Moan, 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 as we all do. Then discovered that uh, I was a real idiot for not wanting to take part of it, you know, with it in the first place, and did. And then became completely caught up in, in, in all of it, and, which I am now. But the important thing is that none of, us, none of us are looking for pats on the back. We're only looking to help those people who, who need the help.